Welcome back to Game Junkies, everyone. I'm your host, Little Elvin, and I'm here with... Mythilin. Really? Yes, really. Gross. When... Ew, gross. My boots. I'm, I'm still waiting gross. for, like, why are you still here? Why isn't Lord here? Because he sucks. Oh, that hurt. So... Dude, he would, like, cry at this game. Just and in case... No see that. <laughs> just in case, I, if I remember correctly, if I remember to cut it, you probably noticed that you missed... Well, then again, if I put it back in through... Well, let's just say, if you missed... Or if we didn't bother putting in the long talk that was the guy's name? Vega and Samuel. Uh, Samuel gave- Vega and Samuel gave you- well, I'm gonna go ahead and give you a quick summary. Blah blah blah. Hell. Blah blah blah. Lots of dead guys. Blah blah blah. Kill everything. Alright, should we do scope or missiles? I like missiles, man, but you do you. No, we'll do a missile, that's cool. Yeah! No, you're letting I, me I, be I myself! Usually do, I usually do scope. Let's try out missiles and see how good that goes. I like the missile. i never done scope, to be honest with you. I never did it. Bam! Yeah, I hear nerd. Bam! Bam! Jesus, dude. Can I do anything else but like make gun sounds? No. Nope. Maybe actually. That's your entire point in this video series. <laughs> Bam! Bam! Look at that! Look at all these dead people. We're gonna explode as oh, I punch them. Oh no, he's he's dead. Put, put your hand on it. It worked! I don't think it would do it again. I mean they wouldn't let you do it unless it would work. Do it again. Damn it! Do it again! No! Do it again! No. Who's in fine. charge here? Oh. Oh, you were right. Huh. Sucks to be that guy. Wow. He got Sucks caught that guy by too. Hell Knight. What a loser. It's like he was looking at me. Bring it! Bring it, son! I, I would love if you could... Like, where's the holograms even come from, you know? Because don't holograms need, like, a base for Are the light to shoot at? Nowadays. But, you know. The future. I don't... Fix the job! I don't think that's how it works. Also, you don't have the double jump yet. Nope. I mean, uh, uh, there's double jump. You get it a couple levels down the road. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I actually like it. It's like one of the, it's like, it's not super noticeable, but it's still really fun to have. Yeah. It's pretty cool. So the, the secret to pl the platforming in this game is to follow the green lights. Yeah, and I have a problem and also not really, because I did get lost a couple times even with the green lights. So, I mean, I guess they made the game for idiots like me. <laughs> so they could be like, oh, well. They're gonna get lost, but then the guy's like, "Well, I mean, I kind of designed the level to be pretty linear." Yeah, but modern gamers. Give me your arm. Oh god, my arm! Like he was still alive. <laughs> like, no, no. Like I'm sure Doom guy wouldn't care. Like, do you? I see. So I have this theory that Doom guy doesn't even care about like anyone else anymore. He just wants to murder demons. That's yeah, a, that's his entire point in life. So if like any human gets in his, oh, that is just like, where did he keep it? Yeah, access granted. Like, do, 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 uh, so what do they? What do you think they made this more like the original Doom? Like, would you think you like it more or less? I think more. I, I mean, I, I think it less because they made it pretty much perfect. Yeah. Uh, I mean, what I was thinking of is like just the uh, because the original Doom was basically just one like I mean for each level it was like one map room like this is kind of the same thing, but I think the main difference was was uh, the enemies were already set in there usually. Yeah. And you ha had to keep on backtracking all the time to find the keys and all that and all and stuff. Like that. This is a little bit. Di well, I did because I could never find them. That's why I always stopped playing Doom. <laughs> was like I couldn't find like a key. Eventually, I was like okay, I'm done. Did Doom work? Uh, did Duke Nukem work the same way? Yeah, yeah, they had keys. Yep. Yeah, I remember, I remember Duke Nukem. I think I liked it better than Doom though. Just because, uh, well, I was young and you could aim up and down. I was like, whoa, cool. And then again, when I was young, uh, N N64 was out, so I guess I could always do that. I don't know why Dude Newcomb was so special. Probably because he was funny. He said words I couldn't say. <laughs> that makes him cool. I never. I wanted to buy the new Dude Newcomb, but then I realized apparently that it's, it sucks. Also, do I have a, yeah. yeah, let's do. Uh, I uh, I don't think I said this. Weapon self damage. That Did I say good. I thought this game was gonna suck? Did I tell the people that? I don't. I don't remember. I don't. I don't think so. So uh, I called it like as soon as I had the first commercial. I called it. Like, this game's gonna blow. Like it's just they're not gonna do it. It's gonna suck, and uh, and everyone's gonna hate it. And then when it came out, I was like, I, I mean, I didn't even pay. I didn't pay. I paid zero attention to this game. I I didn't care. But then everyone's like, oh my god, Doom! Oh, everyone's playing Doom. Everyone's loving Doom. Like, what's going on? They can't possibly bring back a game from like the uh, what early nineties? Yeah, or late nineties. I forgot when this game uh, came. Uh, yeah, I think it was like ninety three or. That was ninety. Uh, God, I'm way off. That was ninety six. Um, but 
I was like, there's no way. Like, redoing games, except for Call of Duty, never goes out well. Even Call of Duty's not that old, I mean, comparatively. That's true, it's nowhere near as old. But it's just, um... Like I didn't, I didn't think that anyone could pull it off. I mean, I mean, they just, I mean, they didn't just do it, but they did do Duke Nukem and failed miserably. And it's, I don't know, you just get this feeling like, oh, they're not gonna do it right. Like everyone's gonna be like, oh, they didn't do it justice. But I think the I, end of this, they really, this one, yeah, they just, they so did. This is so, so I mean, good. Because the, the thing is that they managed to improve the game without really changing a whole lot of it. Yeah. Like I think it's the big thing because it still feels like Doom. It just improved. Like it's just a better game. Yeah, I mean, that's I mean that's I mean, it. They knew what Doom, why Doom was popular, and they just kind of well, you found it. Oh no! Doom guy. Oh no! It's a Vault guy. Cause Fallout's. I love Fallout. Fallout's like, I okay. Back to another game rant. I just love talking about games because <laughs> I play them too much. Uh, so Fallout one and two. I played Fallout two. I never beat it though. Cause God, I didn't want to. Uh, so. I played Fallout 2, and I hear the only reason I bought it and played it was because I mean, well, this was a while ago back at Barnes and, and Noble. I found it like half off, no half price bookstore. I found it, and I was just playing it, and I realized how much it sucked. And I was sitting there thinking, like, everyone, yeah, bring him, break his neck. Everyone was telling me that three was like terrible, like horrible, like two was the the good one, two and one were the great games. So I was like, oh, cool, I'll buy it. And you actually warned me saying that it's nothing like three. Yeah. Cause I love Fallout 3. It's like, oh, this is cool. You go out and explore. This is awesome. And you're like, well, it's like, and it was if, if I'm correct, Fallout 3 was your first open world RPG too. Yeah. So that that was just magical. I know it was something so weird because everything I, I played before that was like either RTS or first person, or a few RPGs that weren't really open worlds. Uh, which ones? I can't. I oh, know. Zelda. Yeah, yeah, Ocarina. Zelda. I and mean, there's a few other ones I probably did too. But I mean, nothing in the in, like nothing like Fallout though. Right. Like Fallout Three. So when I played Fallout Three, it's like, oh, my mind was blown. The every like I thought the graphics were amazing. Like, Whoa. <coughs> and it was just a, it was just great. And then when everyone's like, Fallout Two is so much better, man. Just or Fallout One and Two is so much better. So like, oh, sweet. So I go and buy the game. And I put it in. And you're like, you know, it's not gonna be the same, right? Like, what do you mean? It's like it's not. It's not first. I don't think you're gonna like it. Like, what do you mean? And you tell me how it's a like top-down view instead of the first person. I'm like, I don't care. I'll play it. And I hated it because it was just. I mean, say what you want about Fallout Three. I thought Fallout Two was just kind of boring. And I'm sure everyone says Fallout Three is boring. And and Fallout Two, the wrong, has a ton of RPG elements. But that, I don't know. I like the mixture better. I really do. Like the mixture of RPG and first-person shooter is. It, it's just. It's. It's fun. It's good. Yeah. It's great. Especially with the mods and Fallout Three can have where you can. Because, I mean, raiders can take, like, 20 shots from your uh, machine gun, so the mods yep. you can get to take them, like, maybe two. I mean, it just... I love mixing these two elements together. And that's why. I mean, I... So, end of the rant, I don't like Fallout 2 very much. I think Fallout 3 <laughs> and Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 4 are better. Yeah. Maybe uh, not so story-wise, but... Real quick, back to the game. Which which should we upgrade? Uh, always health, dog. Health and ammo. Okay. Armor sucks. Armor, I mean, armor is pretty good because it lets you build Live. up a lot, lot before you actually take... Health damage. Uh, that's true. Well, because I mean, whenever I think of armor, I think of it as basically health. I mean, yeah. It's just an extension to your health. Yeah. That's why I asked if like if like if I get punched by an imp and it does ten damage to my health, does it do like fifteen to armor to make it different? I mean, I have no idea. Well, yeah. I mean, I never tested <laughs> it. Oh, you found a secret. I'm a secret. No, please. No. Oh, oh, no, please. Oh no, I should be like, wait, 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 wait. Hang on, now. Do it, do it to him. Do it to him. Do it to him. Come on. Don't please. Do oh, I didn't do. So please don't break my arm. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, this. I mean, <laughs> I still think that they look pretty good in this. Uh, in this, uh, the old Doom, the monsters. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's kind of surprising. It just he's looks still weird. Nope, he's dead. I love how this is like. <laughs> it just falls apart. It reminds me of. Uh, I mean, nowhere near reminds me of Rainbow Six, but it does. And I like how they bring back like the old music for it too. Oh yeah, they do, didn't they? I mean, so, I can't yeah, hear. Right yeah, now, I can't hear because I have headphones on. But I remember. I can hear what I'm doing. I remember thinking that I was like, oh, they brought the old music back. Uh, but that reminds me of, uh, they added something in Rainbow Six I thought was cool. So, ah, uh, or I just didn't notice it before. Uh, don't die, please. So, uh, I learned that once you kill, like, they take a, I shot someone in the head or the chest, right? And yeah. they just drop their gun, and they take, like, three more steps forward, and then fall down. Like, whoa! <laughs> That's pretty cool. What is that? I thought that was, I thought that was pretty rad. Uh, 
And then, uh, and this was this was in multiplayer, so you know, the multiplayer guy did it. It was yeah. cool. Just like in uh, Halo Reach, where the guy like reaches out before he dies. I I thought that was cool and stupid at the same time <laughs> because he reaches out right, but then when he dies, he just like does this real, uh, really weird ragdoll where he kind of like starts flopping around and his <laughs> guns go flying. Like what? what? It was really like cool for five seconds, and then you died. Uh, speaking of Halo Reach, my second favorite Halo, by the way. Yeah. Didn't see that one coming, did you? Who? No, I mean, I pretty much agree. Oh. I thought everyone liked, like, uh, Halo 3 was the best or something. I don't know. I think, okay. I think Halo 3 is the third best, uh, personally. Uh, it's it's fine. There's nothing really wrong with it. <sighs> yeah, I mean, I guess. Well, which one's better? I, Except I mean, for Halo I 1. I don't know. Halo all the other ones just kind of blend together for me. Oh, well, because they're all... I mean, they got... Like, I never... Like, you know... They changed the sound design for the Soul Rifle, which I think was a mistake. Yeah. It was so strong in the first one, and they, they sucked it up for some reason. I guess because they added new guns, so they balanced it out. But it just means they changed the sound design. Uh, but I, I keep on saying this, Halo keeps on going forward. It keeps on getting more ridiculous and stupid. Yeah. Like, just, I mean, and don't get me wrong, it's not just Halo that does that. StarCraft, StarCraft 1 was pretty gritty. I mean, it had some weird things in it, but it never went, like too far right uh and then starcraft 2 came out and like oh kerrigan's a god now oh uh, by the <laughs> way I guess spoilers spoilers um, for the last of the three starcraft 2s I mean, and even long? then it's epilogue campaign uh even i mean i still don't care she's a she becomes a god yeah i mean and that's not even the worst part. i mean i mean that is the worst part honestly in my opinion like i just when you told me that i was like i'm done <laughs> like this is stupid this is just got why is she a god but uh um, also doomga God, you keep on finding these guys. Yeah, I know where most of them are. Oh, you should keep on. I think everyone likes those, so keep on finding them. Okay. Um. So, so I'm just sitting there, and, and I noticed how it, when it was going downhill, like Wings of Liberty wasn't too bad. I thought it was kind of, I thought it was kind of dumb how they got Kerrigan back to become a human. Yeah. I guess more spoilers. Uh, like, what do you? This game's pretty old now. Um, and I, but I was like, okay, fine. I mean, it's it's kind of big, but I can deal with that. And then the second one came out. And Kerrigan becomes a Zerg again in, like, in the, f what, fifth mission or something? Yeah. It's something pretty like soon. I'm like, okay. So I was so glad I did the Wings of Liberty where it didn't help whatsoever. Nothing you did in that campaign mattered. I mean, okay, someone's going to argue, like, oh, well, I mean, she was under the control of Amon in the Wings of Liberty, so when you freed her, she could become a Zerg again without being in control. And then I'm thinking, why is she even in control of Amon in the first place? But that doesn't matter. Because uh, the Overmind made her, not Amon. Yeah. And the Overmind was against Amon. Yeah. So Overmind made Kerrigan to fight Amon. So why is Amon in charge of Kerrigan? Nothing makes sense, man. No, and, and that's just, I liked it better when it was just, oh, it's uh, it's just humans versus aliens, basically. It was bloody, it was hey, gory. Buddy. Like this. Yeah. This should really add chainsaws for Marines. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it just got really, and I, but I did notice it really falling. Like, it, I, my last straw was honestly when uh, you fight Amon as Kerrigan. Yeah. That was like, why are there gods in this anyways? Why? Yeah. Why? I mean, I mean, I was fine with them in the backstory, but it's like that there's yeah the Protoss several religion. now surviving because you discover another one in the epilogue campaign, and it's just like God, why is why? I don't why? know. I just don't know. Oh, jeez, dude. We gotta end the episode. That's fine. I mean, we're just... It's it's 20 minutes. Oh, wow. No, it's 16 minutes. I like to, I like to exaggerate you with that. Uh, so, hey, guys. Uh, thanks for watching uh, Doom. Doom. And remember, get your game fix with the Game Junkies, guys. Peace out. Donut, donut, donut. I'm Doom. Donut, donut, donut. Still Doom.